Izzy, where are you? Um, right here. You're supposed to say the shops at Riverside. Today we're at the shops at Riverside. Do you even know why we're here? So a garden makes cupcakes? No, we're supposed to talk about two more of our favorite trends for spring. Triple. Now drop and give me 50. Stay tuned for part two on spring trends with musings from a mall. So my dirty little secret is I am super lazy. So anytime a trend comes along that allows me to look on trend and fashionable without really putting in any effort, I'm all about it, which is why I love this whole athletic sweatsuit trend that's been on the runways this spring and was so happy to see these great alternative apparel sweatpants at Bloomingdale's. And the great thing that makes them more fashionable and less gym gear is that they're actually cut really close to the leg. They have a great capri length, so they're kind of feminine, but they're also a really yummy material and the dark heather is not sort of sloppy and you know you're not going to the gym you could easily go have brunch in this outfit we added this great hybrid of a trench coat and a blazer so it looks like a complete look and not like she ran out of the house in her pajamas and underneath is actually a really cute camisole which uh, pulls up the lingerie look that is on the runway this season and it's our favorite spring color green Very green and since it is in between weather we're going to use the scarf which has really evolved over the seasons you can wear scarves all year round and we chose the blue stripe to keep sort of the military inspiration going throughout and to keep it street to keep it urban to keep it new york keeping it real <laughs> these awesome nike sneakers you can get nike sneakers in great patterns everywhere and if you toss it up with a very cute, well-cut outfit, it's totally feminine and definitely very edgy. When thinking about spring trends, what we really wanted to focus on was the stuff that was truly new. Not just, you know, prints or stripes, which are things that come in style every season. They're synonymous with springs. So what we really loved this season was all the influence of lingerie-inspired details. You can see on this really great Ella Moss dress that we got from Saks that it has these lovely touches of lace that are really just a nice, you know, feminine break from the ordinary. The great thing about these details is that it keeps it very demure. It's not super sexy Fredericks of Hollywood. And to keep it a bit more formal, we added a great blazer. And one of the things that we love about this jacket is it's a departure from your standard denim jean jacket. We really want to elevate this look a little bit and do something that's new and fresh, so we went the blazer out. It's great for evening, it's great to go out on a date, and to keep it springtime and keep it organic, we chose this great jade necklace with a simple silver detail. And just to keep it street like we love to do, we chose you know blue suede boot pumps, so all together, it's four very simple pieces. They have great lines, they have great soft muted colors, and it's a really great way to start off your spring. Thanks for watching another episode of Musings from a Mom. Check out our website for more information on the looks you've seen today. Ooh, where did you get that cupcake? Mr. Cupcakes. Woo!